Uh, Robert Halfon, Jobs Fair, uh, lots of activity here. Well, first of all, can I thank your Harlow for coming along to cover the Jobs Fair. You're always here, great community newspaper for Harlow uh, residents. This is my seventh annual Jobs Fair and it takes six months to organise. It's uh, done by volunteers, done by my team, supported by uh, Stansted Airport, supported by Harlow College and Land Sheriffs, a great Harlow company that provide the uh, security and look after us. I do this for residents because uh, we've got uh, all kinds of companies and organisations here offering jobs and apprenticeships for everyone, young people, anyone and anyone else who wants to come. Can you give me any stats as to how the jobs market is at Harlow at the moment, unemployment, etc.? Yeah, unemployment, we're, we're doing very well. Um, we're, we're, unemployment's gone down significantly since 2010. I don't have the exact stat off the top of my head, um, but I can send it to you to put up in your Harlow. But it's, it's jobs are coming back to Harlow, business is coming back to Harlow. We've got about 60 companies here today, all kinds offering apprenticeships and jobs. We've got the armed forces here, we've got public services here, we've got some great businesses, big and small. And we've had uh, uh, hundreds of job seekers come through uh, since 10 o'clock this morning. So Harlow is uh, open for business and open for jobs and we're becoming the skills capital of the east of England. Do you get a uh, feedback after today, maybe in a few weeks time to say how today went? Yes, we always do a survey with everyone who comes here and the best thing of this whole thing, I always say this jobs fair is worth it. There's so much time to organise but it's worth it if one person gets a job out of it, if one person gets an apprenticeship out of it, then I feel that I've done something good for Harlow, even if only just one. I feel I've changed someone's life, so or helped to. So um, we always ask people, and we try and improve it each year. And also, I should, by the way, I should give special thanks to Harlow Job Centre as well um, uh, for all that they do.